Alrighty, you guys, welcome back to a brand new Big Cherry Retro React here on the ankle. Hey, Ember. The ankle's a little mean. <laughs> so, good day. I hope everyone's having a good one. Thank you so, so much for tuning on in. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Like and subscribe. Become a channel. For today's video, we are taking a look at Power Keeps Going Out, June 1st, 2015. So we're moving right on through, Christ. The second is called Help, June 2nd. Third, Crave, and that's June 5th. And then the last one, Get Your Freak On Tag. I'm not quite sure what that is. I hope it's not going to be anything too, too cringy, but it's also a sit down video. And as we can see, she is in the new girlfriend phase. Look at her actually taking care of herself for once, making it look like she actually gives an F or puts in any effort. That's always how it goes. And then very quickly, we see her slide right out of it, right? But yeah, I don't want to waste too much time, you guys. So let's just dive right on into this, shall we? Hello, everybody. So, uh, right into it. Hey, Amber. I just got out of the shower. I figured I would. Bitch, you are a lot. Look at you. Just make a small vlog today. Like, why not? I really, really don't vlog like I used to. I really want to start vlogging again. I. Yeah, it's almost like Crystal probably completely ditched you at home. Enjoy vlogging. You guys enjoy watching them vlog. Uh... We like talking our ish, but sitting here and actually having to watch your videos, Amber, it's a little tedious. <laughs> I don't want to sound like I'm bitching about it, because I'm certainly not. It's just, it's tedious. It is. She's so dull. Team is a really, really big part of my life. I just don't know what to vlog anymore, like... Well, you don't go out and do anything, so fair. I don't know. I've had a lot of support from you guys in the comments. Oh, by the way, this is so random, not related at all to her. But I've been seeing some comments about the sound, but more specifically how my voice sounds. I know that it sounds a little rougher and kind of shakier. Um, it's because the editing and whatnot that I do to the videos to reduce the background noise. It also affects my voice every now and then. So that's probably why I promise it's not as like gurgly. <laughs> I need to get like a mic, honestly. We'll, we'll get there. Oh, my last quite a few videos and I'm appreciating it so much. You guys really accept me for who I am. What I uh want to show in videos and i just appreciate that so much what's yeah I'm not, oh my god not the destiny reveal you don't talk well it's recording <laughs> wait so did you use crystal's phone or do you have two <laughs> <laughs> Dude, she doesn't want to be on camera. See, Crystal don't like being on camera, but you, you're going to be all about that life, huh? Weird, dude. This is so weird. Feels like she's just kind of showing off to Crystal, like, ha ha, I'm on call all freaking day. Actually, that's probably why she isn't vlogging, because she's calling Destiny for eight hours a day. Oh, I bet you that's it. <laughs> The camera loves me. Oh, yes. <laughs> Look at you. I'll keep... You can hear Crystal talking in the back. Shit. Oh, my God. Eye roll. <laughs> to be fair, they've been talking for quite a few months at this point. Literally starving right now, so I'm eating some... Oh, uh, yeah, I bet. These everything thin... Eye roll. It's just like... Even if you're skinny, to say that, oh, I'm absolutely starving, it's just like, eye roll, eye roll. You're not, but okay. <laughs> pretzels, well, pretzel crisps, and they're so good. They also have a buffalo flavor that I've never tried, 
And I'm, I'm sure you're going to get it. Really, really need to try them. I keep hearing some... That was a dry bag to go to Walmart. <laughs> extreme thunder out there. You need to be careful with that. No rain. Jesus. Claws are dark. I guarantee you she's broken probably multiple blinds. I really hate when it storms. I'm afraid I'm going to get lightning struck. Can you? So the best place to be is in the second story, that's for sure. I just believe it. 31 more days. I roll. I bet you she took like half an hour to make this. <laughs> and doing all this in front of Crystal, dude, it just seems like obnoxious. Like, you guys have the whole house. Why are you stuck in this one freaking room together all the damn time? And I will be meeting Destiny and moving to Florida. Like, what? Y'all. So 31 more days. We got one month to go. Already got boxes. I'm actually starting. Yeesh. Oh, Crystal has to be so freaking happy, dude. Except I bet you Crystal's probably the one doing it. Into pack pajamas, as you can tell. These are pajamas. You know, they fit a lot better if you fold them. <laughs> uh, scarves and sweaters and things like that. Girl, everything that they bought for you, you should leave for them, okay? And if there's any receipts, make sure you keep them. <laughs> I'd be like, oh, I want to return all this crap. I have to organize this. I just threw these on top real quick because they just got clean. All these are like my normal. Those don't look clean, girl. Regular shirts. I'm gonna put it and they just got clean? What? In a completely different box. And I have like my cardigans over there. This is going to be a really long process. And that's like more pajamas that I have to go through. Well, as I'm just... Something tells me she ain't doing that. Sitting here, casually listening to music, listening to the lightning gonna strike me through the window, and all that type of stuff, even though... Could only be so lucky. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Lightning doesn't even make noise, like, I need to get my shit together. The power completely goes out, and then it flashes back on, so that only... Amber, it's daytime. ...means that it's probably gonna go out in a little bit, and that's gonna suck. Destiny wants me to watch Pitch Perfect because I've never seen it before. So she wants to see the second one with me. So I need to watch, obviously, the first one. Dude, how are you? How'd she get so slow all of a sudden? What? Ooh, Fifty Shades of Grey. If you guys have watched that, you should leave it in the comments below and let me know if you enjoyed it. Weirdo. Freaking weirdo. It was alright. I went to see the first one with some friends because I had read some of the first book. Not all of it. I'll be honest. It's corny. Um, <laughs> and I mean, there's some gross out stuff in it. I guess if that's your thing. Sure. But, yeah. Yeah. And it's also weird once you realize that, like, it's actually, it originally stemmed from a Twilight fan fiction. So, <laughs> it's just so weird. It's so weird, in my opinion. Uh, but, no, that shit ate at the box office. So, hey, get your coin. I have my thoughts back and forth regarding that movie, but I don't know. I think it should have just stayed a book, but that's just my opinion. I cannot wait to watch Jurassic Park. Like, literally, Jurassic World, actually, <laughs> is the new one. They're showing the preview right now. Hey, I found it. It's only two ninety nine. dollars so. Amber, you don't pay for anything. Oh, super cheap. You just go and order things you don't even, like, ask? Bitch. One moment, please. She really has the freaking audacity, huh? Oh my god. Yay! It's really oh, yeah. late at night now. I was a fail at vlogging today. I knew it was going to be a pretty bold. Dude, did she even leave this room? Green vlog. But the fact that the power keeps going out. I feel like I notice a lot of you guys commenting that it seems like they're really trying to avoid Crystal's parents, and I'm going to agree. Literally, like, every 20 minutes, and it's off for, like, a minute, it's, like, being really obnoxious. 
This, oh, you poor thing. He's going to be off work just here in a little bit. And when she gets off work, we FaceTime for the rest of the night. Dude, that just sounds like hell. I'm so sorry. So I'm pretty much going to be preoccupied for the whole I mean, there's some people where, like, I can function with them there, whether it's on the phone or in person. But I got, like ish to do you know so if someone's coming over it's gonna have to jive with like me still being able to do stuff and they're being able to be comfortable silence that's one thing that i really look for in friendships and just any relationship in general is if there can be comfortable silence then it's perfect you know not every moment needs to be filled with obnoxious nothingness amber well night i still hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm kind of like trying to get back into vlogging again i'm like not oh i roll the one freaking thing she does and it's her passion oh my god dude to it anymore i remember when i used to do daily vlogs and now i'm like what to vlog i don't know what's life i still hope you guys enjoyed it and i love talking to you guys and i'll see you in my next video bye Jeez, okay, cut us right out at the end there. Uh, Y'all ask me often, like, how do I not lose my mind during the sped up portions? Honestly, I just try to ignore it. <laughs> if I'm not saying something about something that's obviously super stupid and annoying, then just know that I'm absolutely fed up with it. <laughs> and with that, let's go on to the Hello, next. everybody. I'm literally just... Hey, Amber. Girl, can you even breathe? Laying here on my bed for like a quick sec. It's not your bed. And Destiny just went to work, so we just got off of FaceTime. I think- Oh, you poor thing. You poor thing. I'm going to do a little bit more packing today, kind of just cleaning up my room. It's really- It's not your room. Stop. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. I bet even when she moves in with Destiny, she's still always going to say my in reference to everything. She claims ownership over everything of other people's. Like a mess. I'm so like OCD when it comes to Oh my god. I can like everything has to be like so perfect and put in the right spot. And yeah, I bet, Amber. I bet. It just takes me forever. That's probably why I started packing so freaking early. A little bit. That's probably why you're laying here on your bed instead of just doing it. Some pieces every single day instead of like doing it all like a week before. I have a couple like. To be fair, there are certain things that I can put away immediately and other things that have to wait till the last minute. Clothes, um, mainly just clothes <laughs> and like forms of entertainment, you know? The whole place could be bare. I gotta at least have one TV or a laptop, at least. <laughs> garbage bags full of garbage things that i don't want that i don't plan on giving a goodwill i have a couple good brother will bags i can't take everything with me whatever i don't bring with me so literally y'all it was a waste to get her probably half of this crap i'm giving to goodwill i have why don't you give it over to crystal if it's not clothes at least a lot of perfume i will show you guys in a minute how do i pack all this perfume and body spray i need you guys advice so in the comments below can you please help me all of this perfume these are all this girl literally had thousands upon thousands of dollars spent on her over 10 grand a year and she didn't do nothing with it and glass perfumes and I have all these body sprays. These are all plastic. So that's what I need help with. I have no idea how I'm going to pack all this. As you guys- Crystal standing in the back just thinking like, oh, I'm going to get so many of these. <laughs> now I'm like the jewelry queen. So what I did was I bought four boxes. You really aren't. This is of these 76 packs of Ziploc slider. You're freaking kidding me. Oh my God. Bags and I'm just going to put one necklace in each one it makes sense to me right now I'm i bet it does because you're wasteful and idiotic ah <laughs> been downstairs with monkey we have no idea why he's really really sick uh... he has been sick for two days now he hasn't gotten into anything like in the past he's been sick because he 
so why haven't we heard we brought him to the vets not into like candy and chocolates but he hasn't eaten anything like out of the ordinary so we're really confused he has really bad diarrhea he will not eat anything y'all that's not good you need to get him to the vets if an animal does not eat that's severe okay like I know, I know, if Goo does not eat, something has to be majorly wrong. Because that fat ass will eat anything, any time of the day. <laughs> no, I love him. He literally just lays there. He doesn't even... Please bring him to get some help. Oh my god. And sleep. Sometimes he's just literally laying there with his eyes open. We don't know what's wrong with him. We're trying to take care of him. Poor thing. You don't give a fuck about that dog, dude. None of you do. Oh my god. It just makes me so upset because monkey, any animal deserves better, but monkey, oh. So, for all you pretty little liar fans out there, oh, guess shut up. That's what's about to go down right now. Pretty Little Liars? <laughs> pretty Little Liars season 6 premiere. How is this happening already? I'm literally freaking out. I am one of. Oh my god, dude. 24. Let's remember that, guys. This isn't a 14 year old. This is a 24 year old. Okay. The biggest pre low liar fans of the world. I'm so, of the world. so excited. Oh my god. I need to focus. I need to watch this. Let's go. It's kind of late at night right now. And. What? Oh my god. The shift. I kind of just wanted to end my vlog real quick. I didn't even want to end my vlog. I'm going through something right now and I'm just feeling ow ow what could this be I definitely feel like it's crystal related kind of like I just want to shut the world out you ever have those times where you think maybe her and destiny got into a fight <laughs> you literally just don't want to talk to anyone you just want to curl up in a ball and cry well that's me right now so just Oh, let me guess, because Destiny was supposed to call after she got out of work. Destiny probably said, I'm really tired, I'm just going to go to bed, or something, something very reasonable, and it's sending Amber Lynn spiraling. Having one of the moments, I'm sorry this vlog wasn't that thrilling. And of course, she chooses this moment, because her attitude flipped so freaking quickly, she could have waited 10 minutes till she was smiley again. Like, come on, dude. I'll try to vlog again tomorrow. Oh, you poor thing. And I will see you in my next video. Bye. Or do you think she maybe weighed herself? Because, damn, girl. Damn. Definitely departing the crystal era. That's for sure. All right, on to the next. Hello, everybody. Monk hey, Amber. He is okay. I did make a video the other day how Monkey has been really sick. A lot of you were really worried about him as... Well... Duh. Were we completely? Yeah, obviously. That's why you totally didn't bring him to the vets. Completely. He is fine now. Yesterday, he started feeling a lot better. I made sure to try to feed him. Dude, what the hell are these animals going through that they're so sick all the time? You know, slowly, and he started eating slowly, and now he is totally fine. He's eating, he's not getting sick anymore, he has his energy back, he's no more lethargic. I appreciate your- No more lethargic. As is concerned so, so, so much. A lot of you were saying, take him to the vet, take him to the vet, take him to the vet. I could- Duh. And to have agreed more. We were definitely going to take him to the vet if he didn't get any better. What do you mean, dude? Two days without eating for a dog is severe. That's severe, Amber. And, like, sure, okay, he's eating now. There still could be an underlying issue. Like, <clears throat> people like this shouldn't be dog owners. The next morning. Something else I wanted to just talk about is, as you guys know, I am moving in with Destiny. There's always an excuse for why she doesn't get the animal's proper care. I'm really, really excited. Of course, I'm insanely nervous. You guys are probably going to see that through the next few weeks. Imagine just being Destiny and seeing Amber walk up. She definitely doesn't look like the photos. I'm trying my hardest to vlog more. Don't mind this. I've had a rash for... Ew. Right in that crease, huh? A couple weeks now. So soon Ew. As the weather started getting hotter, this formed. A lot of you are getting... Um, no, Amber. As soon as this roll formed, 
that happened. Shut up. You mean such a great and kind support and I appreciate it so freaking much. You have no idea. Then there's two of you maybe who are kind of a little negative about this <laughs> situation. It makes me confused. Why would you Why? You be negative over something that's super exciting for me. I'm really <laughs> Dude. That is such nasty manipulation. Why would you be negative about something I'm happy about? What the fuck? I'm really excited for this move. It's really going to help me just grow as a person. Oh, I mean, yeah, it did. You gained about 100 pounds, so. <laughs> I know I'm going to be happier. I found someone I truly, truly like. I don't want... See, she's saying all this in a very communal area once again. Something tells me Crystal's nearby, and it's supposed to be, like, not manipulation, because I don't think she wants anything from Crystal anymore, except more money. But <laughs> it seems more like a guilt-tripping kind of thing. Like, now, because she's here, she's so unhappy. Anyone to take that away from me. I'm Eye roll. Girl, it's random people on the internet. Shut up. Saying everyone has their own opinion. They're gonna sit there and share it. That's kind of what YouTube comments are for. I just feel like to blatantly tell me that this is not going to work out is kind of- Well, I mean, you're kind of jumping right freaking into it head first like you always have, so. You're rude and very immature. Oh, shut up. <laughs> it's very immature to hop from one girlfriend to the next just because you need a place to live. I have such high hopes for this to work out. If it doesn't work out, that doesn't mean you can sit there and be like, heh, told you so. Like, Well, you know they're going to. Especially because the Destiny era made a lot of people not like Amber. To gamble on someone's life like that, especially something very scary and very new, it's... It's kind of weird. It's also a tad- Oh my god, Amber. Bit disrespectful. I you, you know about that. I don't know how someone could really sit there and be like, I know this is not going to work out. How do you know? That how do you know half the shit you come on here and spew about? Shut up. Oh my god. Really, we're sitting here ranting at the camera over what a couple of comments said? Come on, girl. Come on, this didn't need to be as long as it is. I do apologize if you guys can hear like the leaf blowers outside. Destiny and I are planning a lot. This is taking a lot of planning. A lot. <laughs> We're planning a lot. This is taking a lot of planning. <laughs> I'm thinking a lot of work. We're not just go oh, yeah, I bet. going into this completely blind. Just. I mean, you kind of are. You kind of are. Couldn't even afford just a quick little meet and greet real quick. <laughs> just right to moving in. Please refrain from just being so negative. Girl, just delete the comments and move on. Shut up. Life is about positivity. The more positive. Do you think that's what got her so bent out of shape? The positivity you put out, the happier you'll be. Trust me. Crystal and I. Oh, yeah? Yeah, Amber. How's that working for you? We're about to go run some. Sorry to keep pausing, but. It, it's just reminding me that the people that are overly about spreading positivity but don't ever do it in their actions, it's always a red flag. Like, I grew up listening to Blood on the Dance Floor, okay? And if you know, you know. It was very much about, I mean, they kind of co-opted Plur community, peace, love, unity, respect. And they used that as their message. More so just the lead singer. We're not talking about Jay, uh, who is Dolly in Boulay Brothers Dragula. They co-opted that message and kind of used it to push back against a lot of the negative criticism that the lead singer was getting. Um, once again, if you know, you know. I can't talk about it on YouTube. I'm not Chris Hansen, okay? So, it's bad. And Chris Hansen even did, like, a whole kind of mini-series on it. It didn't resolve much, although 
I will say, I believe their name is Damien now. But if you guys remember the whole Jesse Slaughter situation, they got a full story arc, and it's very nice to see. So if you're interested in that, check that out. <laughs> Random. And so I figured I'd do an outfit of the day. I feel like I uh, yeah, it might as well. <sighs> Pulling those glasses out of the middle of nowhere, dude. I haven't done these in so long, so let's get to it. Just wearing my hair in a ponytail because it's super easy. Triangle diamond earrings I got from Charlotte Ruse. Silver black diamond tiger ring that I got. I hate that freaking thing. It's not a tiger. From shopmissay.com. Black and white netted necklace with diamond. Netted? Girl, it's chained. Like, are you this stupid? Netted? How is a... <laughs> oh my god. That I got from Charlotte Ruse. I'm just wearing this striped shirt that I got from Walmart with this fringy black cardigan. I honestly do not remember where I got the cardigan. That is my outfit for today. Wow. Ooh, the floor. That's what you got. She be a creaking. Ew. Russell and I. I roll. We're going to go to Texas Roadhouse, but she's been craving sushi and so have I. And this is her favorite restaurant. Oh, so Crystal gets to go somewhere? Let me guess, there was a fight, and now you're trying to make up for it. Listen, Amber Lynn doesn't necessarily fully care where she goes, as long as there's food there. So we're at Kappa Garden. It's a conveyor belt, and it's so freaking good here. Oh, just what you need. Is that really where you park? Just right up front like that? Okay. Okay, I'm trying to <laughs> Right on it. Jeez, girl. Oh, that Oh, just what you need. A frozen yogurt place. And don't let it fool you. Sushi really isn't as healthy as people might think it is. Some is, but eh, it's a lot of calories in that rice. I got the cake batter frozen yogurt with gummy bears and cheesecake. Wow. Right, ready for it? Cheesecake and gummy bears. Texture nightmare. So bomb. Destiny, we're thinking about you. Oh, we. Yeah, okay. <laughs> the way that she. Ew. Ew. Destiny was definitely into the food play of it all. Let's be so for real. Yo. Amber. Crystal, start hitting some shots back, okay, dude? She probably laid hands on you so freaking much. Get some back at her. Don't, she says. Why can't you respect that? You know what? It's freaking hot. What are you doing? You have to turn it around. Huh? No, Amber. She's trying to annoy you the way you annoy her. How close is it? Uh -uh. This is for my vlog. This is so modern, Amber. It really is. Like, how quickly the freaking personality changed. Oh, it looks in here. Thanks, Amber. You've shown us before. Oh, you just have to record people's kids. Yeah, that's why. And people just trying to enjoy their day at work. Can you F off? The girl who works here must really, really like it. <laughs> You're so creepy and weird. I'm giving Crystal some of my gummies. I think I prefer it without it. Wow. Oh, nope, nope. I like the one thing's better. Wait, I think the cheesecake is what makes it bomb as well. Shocker. Oh. Hold on, Gooby's whining. Good lord. Incoming. Come on. Where are we going next, Target, for some duffel bags? Girl, oh my god. Are you still recording? Come on, Slowpoke. Jesus. Unlock it. Look at them, girl! 
Look how. Sheesh. <laughs> you can see the cart. Oh, freaking cute. We got ourselves some. Ready for this? Uh, try to go pet one. This duck something. Hello, baby. Duck something. She's so stupid. Please. I made Crystal park the car just because I had to look at them. I want to get. Oh, I bet. Out so bad. I'm going to try it. Amber. <laughs> Listen, maybe you could get away with it if they weren't with their babies, but that time of year, you don't want to go anywhere near them. I don't want to scare them, though. Oh, dude, no. They're going to scare you. They're just so cute. I can't. Oh, my God. <gasps> I swear it just hissed at me. Yeah, brother. It's going to get you. Hi. They're hissing, Crystal. Aw. I won't get any like closer. You. Get her. Get her. Come watch, on. watch me take a step closer. Watch their mouths. See? <laughs> Aw, I don't want to bother you. Well, you kind of already are. Bye! I'm scared they're gonna get me. Crystal, they freaking hiss at me! <laughs> Brother, I would too. Yeah! Every time I got closer, they're like... <laughs> I just got out of Target. I went there to get a duffel bag. When Destiny comes and picks me up... <sighs> on July... I roll. My second. Her and I are actually going to Kentucky for like four days. That's where her mom and some of her family lives. So we're going to be staying there for 4th of July and some extra days. Christ, bringing the new found stray cat in for the first time and going right to your parents. Eesh. Eesh. Destiny. Sloppy. I needed a duffel bag just to make life easier. My hopes were set on a pink, really cute duffel bag. Oh my god, I roll. Target does not have many duffel bags. They were pretty freaking ugly, I must say. I oh, you poor thing. Tried to search in the purse aisle, which I got lucky. I found a pretty cute one. I guess I can show you guys when I get home. I'm a Brother, a purse for moving? Oh god. I'm about to go to Walmart because I need to do a little bit of grocery shopping. Why do you need to? Like, why, dude? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, they're really pampering her the last month, and it's driving me insane. That one's too big. Yeah, you know about that. That one has spots. That one's smushy. Oh, that's spots. It's so hard to find the perfect freaking thing. Almost hard as a rock. Amber, oh my god. <laughs> Crush them, please. Nope. Dude, this is getting very obnoxious. What are you doing? Why are you always putting a butt in my face? Because your butt looks like a face. Oh, I know. You just want to tempt it. I want to. Fair. I'm also asking myself that your butt is a face. What the fuck? <laughs> Y'all, I'm tired. It's early. You guys, the duffel bag I got. This was definitely by far the cutest one, and I actually really like it. I'm just hoping it's big enough. Chazam. It. Yeah. it actually looks really big on camera. Black with sequin stripes. This is from Tar. Sequin stripes. $35. I also got a shirt. $35 that you don't have. I probably shouldn't have, but uh, I did. Purple, and then in the front, there is like this netting. I thought it was super cute. How do we know it's going to fit? Obviously, I'd wear it with a cardigan because I don't like my arms showing. Really? Because you show them quite often. <laughs> I'm sorry, just the face. <laughs> Freaking funny. <laughs> I had definitely oh my god, don't just like 
whip him around like that, dude. Her, whatever. <laughs> oh my god. You almost just fell with that cat stuck in your claws. Jesus, Amber. Uh, she just always pisses me off. It's really late right now. I need to end my vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I will see you in my next one. Bye. Ish. She had to get one last breath in there right at the very end. <laughs> All right, on to the next. Okay, hey, Amber. I'm just going to beat her to the punch on that one. Look at her trying. Yeesh. Good lord. I'm trying to make my hair cooperate. Yes, even though my name is not Michael. Hello, everybody. Weird. That was weird. I'm here to do that. Get your freak on tag. The Ew. Get your freak on tag consists of 15 questions. Ten plus five, fifteen. Okay, Amber. Oh my God. Can we just get this over with, girl? Oh, this video is only five and a half minutes, so it's not as long as I thought it would be. One. What's a nickname that your family calls you? Well, you don't have family, so <laughs> sorry. When I was a little girl, my uncle would call me Chewy. My grandma. Uh, yeah, I wonder why. Would call me Pumpkin. My wonder why. Dad would call me Princess, and Mom would call me Ambies. Mm. Two. What's a weird habit of yours? I'm not really a person who ha you eat too much. Has weird habits. I can't even think of any right now. Something I could think of off the top of my head is that I'm constantly wearing more than one shirt. I'm wearing a floral tank top, a black tank top. That's a weird habit, girl. That's just because you're insecure. And another black tank top. But damn, okay. She wears more layers than I thought she did because that was one of my main critiques, I guess, is she needs to wear more layers so it kind of acts as, you know, a slimming control thing, holds stuff together. She looks that bad with that many layers on? Oh, damn, girl, okay. Well, it might be just a lost cause then. <laughs> and a cardigan. The reason I do that is I feel a lot- Who's Anna Cardigan? <laughs> more comfortable with more clothes on me. Plus, the black tank top I have under this tank top kind of slims me down a little bit. Yeesh. <laughs> it ain't doing much, so goddamn. Three, do you have any weird phobias? I do. It is called tripophobia. I wow. This is kind of the first mention of it, isn't it? But the thing is, though, look at all the jewelry that she owns. Anyone that has, like, actual trypophobia wouldn't own half of the shit she has. Don't want to talk about it. I will leave the word right here. You guys can Google it. Even just talking about the word or thinking about it in any sort of way honestly gives me the goosebumps and I start to cry. I <laughs> Eye roll, dude. I do not want to go there right now. <laughs> It is probably by far one of my biggest phobias ever. Four, what's a song you secretly love to listen to and belt out loud when you are alone? Honestly, I'm the type of person who is not ashamed in the music that I love. I see- Girl, you're not ashamed in anything. Secretly do sing. Shh, no one needs to know. I'm not a good singer. A no, we all know. One that I'm really, really enjoying recently is I Think I'm In Love by Kat Dahlia. So I'm gonna say that What? Song. Five. What's one of your biggest pet peeves? I must admit, I have quite- Why does she keep putting the glasses on and off? She doesn't even need them. A few pet peeves. When people sigh, because that just means they're annoyed. When Brother. Oh my god. These are just how I like to micromanage people. People slam things, such as cupboards- That's very ironic for you. Doors, windows, dishes, anything. People who- that's literally what you do. But for her, I guarantee you it's a trigger response. I think they know everything. Eye roll. Amber, is this all just stuff that you do? My God. Selfish people. <laughs> okay, Amber. Just all around jerks. Let me guess. This is for destiny. Six. What's one of your nervous habits? 
when I get nervous, my stomach tends to be in tons and tons of knots and I feel ill. That normally causes me to ache. This definitely feels kind of like a learner's guide to being around Amber Lynn. And it feels like she's posting it for Destiny. She said Destiny watches the videos, so... Mm. A, shut down, or B, talk a mile a minute. From experience, something that makes me extremely nervous is when we have tornado warnings or watches. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh, but girl, you better buckle up then. You're going to Florida. Or when we're having really, really bad storms. Normally when something like that is happening, my stomach is in knots and I'm literally going psycho. I roll. Oh my god. I just know that's so annoying to be around. Seven. And can you just imagine how bad it probably was when it was just her and Destiny in an apartment? Because we saw during the Crystal Era, they relied heavily on the parents when those storms came to, like, help calm them down and whatnot. Without that, uh. What side of the bed do you sleep on? Oh my god, Amber. <laughs> this is my left side, right? I sleep on the wall side, which is the left side. Eight. If you're on the bed, if you're standing there, it's the right hand side. Eight. What was your first stuffed animal and what was its name? When I was a little girl, I had tons of stuffed animals, but I don't re this is weird. remember any of their names. Earliest stuffed animal that I remember having was a teddy bear that I got from a dumpster. The most random place in the world I know. Brother, I believe it. Oh, I named that bear Bamantha. It's a bear. Bear starts with a B. Instead of Samantha, I just added the B to Samantha, and I created Bamantha. I don't know. Wow. Nine. What's one drink you always order at Starbucks? That was probably a lie. Honestly, back in the day, I'd always, always, always order the vanilla bean frappuccino. The last couple of times I went, I just got the Tazo tea in passion fruit, my bad. <laughs> I'm not really a tea wow. lover, but that is actually super, super delicious. Because it's got a lot of sugar in it. <laughs> 10. What's the beauty rule that you preach, but you actually don't practice it? I feel like... <laughs> Everything. Beauty could be a lot of things, whether it be about your hair, makeup, body in general, or just the things you put inside of your body. It doesn't always have to be what you put on the outside of your body. Something I preach is that people should be healthy. They should eat fruits, vegetables, drink their water. Those are very important key components <laughs> <laughs> but then there's me. To be beautiful on the outside. More importantly, it makes you beautiful on the inside. To be healthy. Uh, I mean, I know what she's getting at, but Amber, what makes you a good person on the inside is actually being a good person, okay? Even if you lost all the weight, you'd still be shite. Healthy is to be beautiful. That's really, really important to me. Lately, I have not been practicing that. So I don't have a... Oh, go figure. 11 fingers, so 11. Which way do you face in the shower? What? I face... <laughs> she faces sideways and bends her head in, so she doesn't actually have to step in. Away from the water. 12. Do you have any weird body skills? Not... Ew. Many people can do this, which I find kind of strange, because to me it just comes so easily. I can touch my nose with my tongue. I'm sure. Wow. A lot of people can freaking do that. That was so attractive. Thir Amber, I don't think there's an attractive frame in this entire video, dude. Sorry. Teen, what's your favorite comfort food? Ben and Jerry all the way. No ifs, ands, or buts. Ugh. Ben and Jerry's is the name. That is my go-to. Ew. Look at her. A little freaking fiend christ dude she just triggered the binge monster that's what that is right into action Ooh, ben and jerry they're so evil but it's so delicious girl don't blame them for your freaking problems okay my god i grew up in the damn state and i never ate ben and jerry's as much as you do Teen, what's a phrase or exclamation that you tend to say crystal Oh my god. Is there like a phrase or an exclamation that I tend Exclamation? Do you just like have her stay by the door outside? What the fuck? I say a lot of... I don't know. 
know either. I can't think of anything. Probably, are you mad at me? <laughs> well, if you don't know, I don't know. Oh my god. Charlie Maisie. That should be it. Oh, I'm saying it. I'm saying it. So it's either Charlie Baby or brother Ruby Rose. If you guys don't watch, what? When the hell has she ever freaking said that in a video? What the fuck? Orange is New Black. You need to watch Orange is New Black. Oh, of course she loves her. Of course she's got the freaking Justin Bieber teenage boy aesthetic. Oh my god. Because Ruby Rose, I'm about that life. Yeah. She gives me life. Life is given when Ruby Rose is on my TV screen. That's not even an okay. exclamation. That doesn't even make sense. Charlie, you need my purse fall. Oh, how dare he. I'm going to get you 15. I believe it. When it is time to sleep, what are you actually wearing? And I Ew. go to sleep, I am wearing just a shirt and panties. I Ew. Ew. So, you're doing that next to Crystal? Ew. Do you want my bra to sleep sometimes? Oh my god, dude. That's just an image I don't need. Actually, probably 99% of the time. Uh, uh, unwashed. Oh, uh, you know those. That's why they don't be using sheets. I know a lot of people say that's not good for you. To each their own. What do you mean? What do you mean, girl? Side eye. I don't care how people dress, like, or when they sleep. It's just, ugh. I hope you guys enjoyed this tag. I hope you guys enjoyed my answers. I hope you guys just enjoy this video in general. I will see you guys Weird. in my next video. Bye. Ew. I love you guys. Ew. Don't you ever forget it. Uh, all righty, y'all. Wow, this one's long enough. It felt like a real chore. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. She was just really annoying. Oh, oh, this is the destiny personality. So we're gonna have to put up with this for like a year and a half. God damn it. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, thank you so, so much for tuning on in. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Like and subscribe, become a child. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will catch you in the next one. Take care.